Hi everybody, it's Lee of CJ and Drill. Now, what you're looking at here, it's been raining a little bit. We're in Seattle and it's rained this morning. But this is the side of my van. I parked it on the street, somebody hit it. Now I have a long scratch here, okay? And once you get past the cover for the gas cap, we've got a dent here. And I'm gonna try to pull it using Believe it or not, is a plunger. It's an old shop trick. Let's see if it will work on this dent. What I will say is, my only concern is, it's close to the tire tire well. And I may not be able to get a good seal on it, because it's really important that you get a good seal. Okay, so I'm gonna pour a little hot water on it first, just to heat it up. Oh, that was pretty good. Yeah, you're getting it. I will tell you that the dent is greatly diminished, but you know, it's still a fail because it didn't take it out. There's a crease here. You have to really have ideal conditions. The plunger's gotta really have an airtight seal. If you don't get a perfect seal, you're not going to get the suction you need to really pop that dent out. And I think that was our case. We couldn't get a really great seal, and that the fact that it was close to the tire well, it, it prevented us from really getting the kind of pulling power we needed. Now what I will say is, I think that a plunger works in an ideal situation, but not a situation like ours. I'm going to have to call this a fail. Now this is another route you can take. It's where you attach wooden dowels to the surface of the car by way of hot glue and then you just, once the glue sets up, pull it and pop the dent out. Now I'm going to take my dowel here and I'm going to drill a hole through the center. And what that's going to do is it's going to provide a little handle for me to grab onto. And what I'm going to do, put my hot glue gun, I'm going to put a little dab. And I've got a dent right there I want to pull. I'm going to just keep repeating. right there right there now I just need to allow this to set up and then I'm gonna pull that dent okay I've got my wooden dowels in place they're they're firmly attached okay the hot glue has set up now I want to say this to you if you have any concerns whatsoever about the finish on your car your paints finish you may not want to go this route, okay? You might want to find another alternative. I popped that. You wind up with a little residual glue like this. I have some uh, plastic razor blades. Now what I will say is I was able to remove most of the dent. I have a, a little, a few little dimples here and there, but for the most part I'm pretty satisfied. This is Leah saying you can do this. See you next time.